Hello viewers, this is FX Cave. In this video, we are going to see how to use Laugh tool. Laugh is basically a good modeling tool, but most of us won't use this. Using this, we can make many complex shapes. For example, we can make 3D model of snail and shell easily using Laugh tool. But in this video, we are going to see how to make a trident using Laugh tool. For that, we can take a straight image of a trident. You can also download the Trident PNG from the fxcave.com site. I have given the download link in the below description. Now go to the front view in the attributes. Click mode then go to view settings. Then click on back on the triple dots. Then click the Trident PNG which you have downloaded. Which suits to the backdrop. Let's create a circle. We can keep that in the X and Y axis. You can see the trident is little bit moved. Always remember that X and Y axis should be in the center of the object. Then only we can create a 3D object easily. For adjusting it, we are going to view settings. I am adjusting the X axis little bit. That is 4.2. Next, we can reduce the radius of the circle. Move the circle towards trident's bottom of the edge. Now select the circle. Hold Alt and click Laugh. Laugh will appear as parent for the circle. Next, duplicate another circle. It will appear as circle 1. Now move Y axis. Circle upwards. It makes a cylindrical shape. Duplicate another circle. Now I am going to increase the radius of it. If you need, enable X-ray mode for better visualization of the backdrop. Now duplicate circle 1. It was named as circle 3. Move the y-axis of the circle 3 near circle 2. Follow the steps correctly as per what I am doing. Now. In laugh properties, select linear interpolation and subdivision per segment. If you need, you can select it. I need an equal segment, so I removed it. Now adjust the mesh subdivision U and V of the loft for the segment level. Adjust the same parameter what I have done. Next, select the circle, increase the radius little bit because it is slightly bent. Okay, this is the basic. I am going to make all other shapes in this way. Make little bit adjustment until the shape is perfect. Okay, now I got the shapes which I need. Now, again enable the see through option. It will be easy to see the background object too. In some areas, I need some more corners. So, I am adding another circle by duplicating another circle. Now I got a curved object. I can manage myself what curveness I need. I am doing the same steps again and again. The only thing I am doing here is increasing or decreasing the radius of the circle according to the curve of the trident shape. So follow these steps continuously.
until now there is no problem from now the trident shape changes now i am selecting the top circle by pressing c in my keyboard i can change that circle into a, a display now you can select all vertex using shortcut control a which i have selected now change that into a linear so you won't get bezier mode we need only sharp edges okay follow the steps carefully these steps were already seen before Hold shift and reduce the size of the vertex. If I press shift and scale it, it reduces to zero. We got the shape what we needed. But it is too sharp. So undo one step backward. Select all line shape right click and click on chamfer now i am going to scale this to zero which we made in previous steps now i am doing the previous steps for the sideward shape Okay, we got one side. So, duplicate the same shape for other side. If you change the scale value as minus 1 parameter, the same shape will be copied to the left side or you can also do this using symmetric tool. Okay, finally we made a cool trident. Not only we can make a trident using loft, you can also make many models using loft by your practice. You can also make cool 3D models using loft. By practicing it only, you can create more models. If any doubts, ask your comments or by contacting FX Cave Facebook page. You can find this Trident 3D model in fxcave.com. That download link is given in the description below. Ok viewers, see you in next useful video. Until then, stay connected to fxcave.com. Thank you.